So at the top of the year, when I started Jumping Jack Tax to allow people to start their own tax offices, I realized that Instagram wasn't going to be enough and that there are literally so many other social media platforms that I'm not reaching. For example, YouTube has billions of people in there podcasting. And I realized that if these social media sites are going to give me free opportunity to be able to reach as many customers as possible, why am I not taking advantage of that? Only a fool would do that, especially in the time where I don't want to look back 10 years from now when social media was at an all-time high and I didn't take advantage of every single opportunity. So I said, you know what? Year 2019, I want to start my own podcast. What do I got to do? I called this guy and he had came into the office. This was about, I want to say two months ago. And he said, hey, what's going on, Don? Yeah, we can set up your whole podcast. I I had a radio station for the past five years and um, we can set it up. It's going to be about $5,000. And I said, 5,000, what? (laughs) Bro, I'm not paying any of that money. I'm not doing it. So like most people, I hear something that I didn't like. I threw it to the side. And that's probably what you normally do if you don't have a business right now because you you started looking at prices. You started looking at how much work was going to be required. And you're like, you know what? I'm going to put it to the side and you never get back to it. And then next thing you know, by December 2019, you're going into 2020 saying new year, new you. We're not doing that anymore. And I said to myself, I'm not doing that. So about three, four days ago, I'm sitting at home, I'm watching the Sixers game, and uh, I started YouTubing how to start a podcast right on YouTube because YouTube is like the new university. So I looked it up, and to my surprise, there were a thousand videos that showed me how to set up an entire YouTube station. Started watching the videos, put in a few hours, and by the way, if you wanna get into any business, please do not think that you're not gonna have to put in the amount of hours and effort to be able to study your craft, to understand there's so much free resources. All you gotta do is type your hands away the same way that you do on the shade room, looking at all of these celebrities and all of these blogs. If you put that same amount of effort into something that you wanna start, I guarantee you that you'd be so much further ahead in life. We just gotta switch up our priorities, right? So. I go to YouTube, next thing you know, I'm, 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 reading, I'm, I'm reading up and I'm watching all of these videos. They're literally showing me step by step how to piece everything together, all the way down to the exact products that I need to buy. So the next day, I, I took action. And let me tell you something, in entrepreneurship, it's about taking action. The second that you think of something and somebody tells you to do something, take action immediately because all you're gonna do is throw it back to the back burner and it's never gonna get done. So I said, I'm taking action, pulled out my debit card, Will you believe that I went to Amazon and I literally bought every single thing that you're looking at right now from this stand to this microphone to this pop filter? I don't even know what this is. Half of this stuff. I just I just was clicking all on it on YouTube. Got all of this stuff, headphones, the the software and everything. And I'm coming to you today with an entire podcasting studio set up in a matter of two days straight from Amazon and two tables from Ikea. Now, that's so extraordinary to me because 10 years ago, that would not have been possible. But today's age with social media, we have the ability to be able to create our own products, create our own websites, create our own mobile applications, and everything is right there at our fingertips. We just got to actually take the action to do it. So I'm just letting you know right now, if you want to be an entrepreneur, please promise yourself and promise me that you're no longer going to say you're going to do something that something is going to be on your list and next thing you know at the end of the year it doesn't happen we have a beautiful opportunity here i want to see everybody win i want to see us all grow especially with this situation going on with gucci to where literally uh they're putting racism right in our faces you now have the opportunity where so many black people are coming together to want to support each other that you need to start a business so that they can support you stop being on the outside looking in actually get on the game get in the field get on the field (laughs) god is calling you get on the field yo your your purpose is right here get on the field the coach is telling you to get in make it happen for yourself i'm prince donnell the pastor of business let's work in 2019 people